welcome back to Sneaky Business, the show where we talk about sneakers, season two. I'm Russ. This is Dallas. We're going to talk about skate to start off today. Um, and Nike's got some cool skate stuff coming out. There's a Dunk SB high and a flamingo color, which is really cool. It's like a grey sort of speckledy upper with a really cool like teal sole. They look really nice. And Janoski is doing the cork flavor. Cork's the uh, the go-to at the uh, at the moment for Nike. They're doing everything in a cork. Air Force Ones, Blazers, uh, Air Max 90s, Nineties, LeBrons. LeBrons, the Janoskis have come out now. Sweet. Yep. Really cool. Janoskis are cool looking shoe anyway. Hard to go wrong. Corks are cool. Um, I like that. Alright, moving on. That's skate done. Knock that out. Go bunga, man. This segment is brought to you by Picnic. Deliciously ugly. Um, and this is our deliciously ugly shoe of the week, and it goes to Air Max Plus, also known as TNs for all you idiots that don't know that they're actually called Air Max Plus. Air Max Plus ones in the Tiger, orange, black, white sole, the Jewel Air Bubbles. This is the lad staple, but this is the OG of the lad staple. It is. Deliciously ugly. <laughs> Alright, casual shoes. Uh, casuals is just ridiculous amounts coming out right now. It's summer in the US, so we're getting a lot of uh, summery, florally, crazy, cool, bright colours. Um, again, we just talked about the corks, the blazers, and the uh, Air Force Ones coming out in that. Uh, but the superstars, Adidas is doing a superstar with a metal toe uh, where the shell toe is. It's metal, it's got a snakeskin back. Yeah. You gotta have some serious juice to run this shoe. You gotta know what you're doing. That rest of that outfit better be on point. You don't wanna wear that, wear that wrong. Reebok, Reebok Palm Insta Furies are going nuts right now. There's heaps of stuff coming out. There's a splatter pack, um, and there's also a mastermind by Reebok Palm Insta Fury, uh, which is pretty much black, white sole with the mastermind skull and crossbones on the back. Really cool, a little bit different. Black mm. and white shoes always good. Skull and crossbones always go down good. Clean colorway and mm. hey, Arr! it's gonna have a Arr! big mark Shiver for the old timbers. <laughs> uh, also, uh, sticking with Reebok Pump Insta Furies. No, wait, 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 wait. Also sticking with Reebok Pump. <laughs> Reebok Insta Pump Furies. Shit. It's a mouthful. Let's face it. Reebok Pump Insta Furies. No, Reebok Insta Pump Furies. <laughs> See, anyway. These colorways are so dope <sighs> that Russ just can't get too excited. It's like going on a date with a hot chick who's like dead set three three points ahead of you. <laughs> I'm frothing. I'm frothing. Punching above your weight and you sort of get nervous and. <sighs> I'm frothing. Um, so the splatter pack's coming out in the Insta Pumps. Yeah. Um, the teal with the cement is literally mm. the raddest thing ever. It's fresh in the Mentos. Um, it's the red and blue is uh, pretty nice too, with the black on the side. And there's also um, like an orchard color, which is like a purple and a, and a navy blue, which is a little bit more subtle. But that teal thing, woo! Oh, boom! Oh, yeah, yep, yep. cool. Mm. Even Dallas likes it. Dallas hates everything else. I hate everything. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're but cool. I like that. Yeah. Well, I'll try and get some for Dallas in a size 14. Mm. In a in a not to squeeze them into a 13, I think. But they're fresh. Mm. Oh, they're nice. fresh. Um, Roshi Runs are doing the whole polka dot thing. What do you think of polka dots, Dal? Uh, well, look, you know. Not no. for your shoes, just for your bikinis, huh? Yeah, that's it. The yellow is probably the craziest one if you want to be ridiculous. Otherwise, just get the black ones. So, speaking of polka dots and bikinis, Leads us into the lady stuff. Ladies! Yeah, buddy. Um, stuff for the ladies. There's a Nike Juvenate in a polka dot, which is really similar to a Roshi. Comes with smaller dots for the girls. A bit more feminine. Yeah. I don't know. I don't think girls can wear the men's ones. <laughs> but no, I was so. going to say, I've never seen a manly polka dot in my life. Mm, but, no. Yeah. no. If there is one, I'll be the first to have no. it. Something else for the ladies is... New Balance have a plaid pack, also known as a lumberjack pack. There's about three New Balance coming out, all in sort of different different colours of um, what's the Tartan. other shit called? Tartan, Tartan. you know, yeah, your different. Scottish throwbacks. Yeah, yeah. they're cool. Yeah, it's all good. It'll be something really different for the girls. I don't mind it. I'll, there's a navy blue, 
with the green through it, it looks like the Wallace Darden, really cool. Yeah. I like it. And then it's a girl shoe. People yeah. let down. Yeah, well, yeah. For the girls that some jeans and match up with a scarf or something. For the girls that don't want to wear girly stuff, this is it. Yeah. New Balance has sorted you out. Go and find them. They're out now. Um, and also, Jordan 7s are coming in a hot lava in a grade school, which is pretty much girl sizes. That's yeah. code. Grade school code. is code for girls. Um, white, black, and hot lava accents. Yeah. They're cool. I want a pair. Yeah, I think they'd, they'd probably sell quite a few of them if they were less than a men's. It's... Speaking of Jordan brand, we're going to talk men's Jordan brand now. Uh, some big things coming out. The 11 Lab 4s in the red. Now, you'll know this. You know those stormtrooper dudes mm -hmm. in Star Wars with the red? Something like Rebel Imperials or something. Mm -hmm. What are they called? Uh, the Emperor's Imperial Guards. <laughs> there you go. That's what these are. Mm -hmm. That's what they are. This is them in a shoe. Yep. Flat out. I saw it and I was like, that's those dudes from Star Wars. Dallas will know about that. Yeah, plastic sort of red looking... Just, just red. It, it's oh, just it's, so it's, red it's and a, so shiny and yeah, it's no, 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 no. deal. Um, Westbrook's got a new lifestyle shoe out with Jordan, the Westbrook Zero. We talked about it last series. Uh, it comes out this weekend. Yeah. Um, it looks really nice in the all white. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of all white shoes, but this looks really nice in all white. Yeah, no, it's got a couple of different colorways, but um, yeah, it's pretty fresh. It's just a classic sort of st silhouette. Yeah. It looks nice. It looks like a really luxe shoe, you know, a real luxury sort of, you know, if it came from Prada or Gucci or something, you know, $800 yeah, price tag. Yeah. But it's Jordan Brand, it's Westbrook, and this is probably the first thing he's ever done that I've liked. Yeah. <laughs> also, big news with Jordan Brand, Supreme is teaming up with Jordan Brand, and they are throwing down some desert camo. Who doesn't like a bit of camo? <laughs> Everyone loves camo. I'm surprised you can even see me on screen because I'm wearing camo. <laughs> Um, Desert Camo, Jordan 5s, you know, a bit of Supreme, mm. bit of Supreme love on those Jordans, they're sick. Yep. They're sick. Um, but, you're not going to get them, don't no. worry about it, people are going to, people are going to line up for like six people months on these, they're going to hack the internet, they're going to do all that stuff. Yeah. Um, I'm predicting, you know, a couple grand on eBay that same day that they come out, these Big are going to be nuts. Yeah, very limited release, like they'll be on eBay. <sighs> Triple, quadruple, instantaneously, it's the same day they're actually sold, so... Crazy. If you want them... Good luck. Mm. Start saving. Yeah, good luck. Or rob a bank. <laughs> or a servo. <laughs> or about a hundred of them. Natural mm. born killers. Mm. Welcome back to Sneaky Business. We're going to talk about some basketball stuff again now, because we just love it. We can't get enough. Um, however... That's what life's about, isn't it? It's the off-season, there's not much happening. However... There's one big thing happening. Nike has just come out with, um, uh, I guess, a shoe for people with disabilities who can't actually tie up laces and that sort of thing. They come out with a, a zip system that goes around the back of their basketball shoes. It's come out on LeBron, LeBron James' um, Zoom Soldier. Uh, it's a really cool system. I haven't seen anything like it before. But basically what happens is, from around the back of the shoe, you've got a zip now attached to a Velcro tab. So as you undo it, the zip undoes, the whole back of the shoe comes away, you slide your foot out, again, to get them on, boom, foot in, zip goes all the way around, you tag it off with that Velcro, genius. It took them three years to develop, um, you know, really, really cool idea, really pushing the edge, yeah. um, and now everyone can just do it. Oh. <laughs> oh! I got that off the internet, yeah, I saw yeah, someone yeah, say yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I stole that. I'm oh, sorry, I put two dollars in the square just. I hope it sticks around. Nice, nice to hope... see there's something different, something new that they're trying, you know. So good on you Nike. The only other big thing in basketball at the moment is LeBron James's, um, what's for breakfast? Did you finish your breakfast? Finish your breakfast. Eat your breakfast. <laughs> You know, some, something about breakfast. Yeah, basically, you know, it looks like someone... Looks like someone threw up their breakfast. Or something, something. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like someone had got all their Fruit Loops. Fruit Loops, and, up and someone's and done this, and it's just gone bleh. So, LeBron, finish your breakfast. Dallas loves him, he's going to get three pairs. Yeah. This is the first LeBron I think Dallas hasn't liked. No. Ooh, Come on. plenty of them. Second LeBron Dallas hasn't plenty. liked. Doesn't like that kitty stuff. <laughs> That's all we've got time for in this episode of Sneaky Business. Thanks for watching. Episode one in the bag. 
Episode 2 will be coming out soon. Back! Welcome to Season 2! Bigger, <laughs> better, and colder than ever! <laughs> we might get some heaters down here in the basement, yeah, what do you think? I think so, yeah. It's All right. Cold. Peace!